What's going on, you guys? It's me, Mr. Ollie with 5245. Wow, what a wrestling weekend. It felt like it was WrestleMania weekend, actually. NXT totally delivered. Um, SummerSlam, it could have been better. It wasn't the best. But the Cesaro Kevin Owens match was sick. And then Raw last night. The return of the Dudleys was freaking amazing. <laughs> Don't mind my son, I'm just outside enjoying the wonderful fresh air. Dudley's returning. WWE needed that. A good refresh in the tag team division. Bringing back veterans. Maybe to put over guys or maybe they're giving one last run. Who knows, but we'll find out. And then... Sting coming out at the end. Kind of saw that coming. <laughs> it works perfectly. As you can see, my son is just excited to be outside. You know? Well, in this video, I'm not going to talk about NXT, Raw, or SummerSlam. I'm just giving you a quick review of what I thought. I'm talking about Sting, actually. Well, I remember. When I first saw Sting, I wasn't a big WCW fan at first. I grew up with WWF slash WWE now, and don't mind the lawn mowing. It is nice out, and people are taking advantage of the time to mow lawns. And um, I was Hogan's, one of Hogan's fans, you know? And uh, my dad, he loved wrestling as much as I do. You know, and Hogan left, and we found out he went to WCW. We're like, huh? Eh, let's let's give it a look. I never really heard much of WCW. I haven't heard of anybody, frankly, when I about in WCW. Because when I was growing up, it was WWF. That's all everyone ever talked about. And then I remember the first Nitro, when it was Hogan and Flair. I knew who Flair was. And that's all I really remember from the card was Flair and Hogan. No, f no, f Flair and Hogan. Or it was Sting and Luke Flair. I don't remember. The, I think it was Hogan and Bossman. I believe that was the main event. And anyway, Luger comes out. And I was like, oh, okay. And then I saw Sting. I was like, who's this guy? What's he doing? I was like, okay. And my new Macho Man, obviously. Macho Man later came around. But then I started watching more. And then Sting grew on me. I didn't know much about him. And he, I was getting more intrigued and intrigued by him. And then the whole NWO storyline kicked in. And then Sting was not colorful. He was black and white like my shirt, his shirt. Like the crow. The Crow is one of my favorite all-time movies of all time. And um, he was dark, he was mysterious, hardly talking, anything. He carried a baseball bat. He had it all. Nobody knew if he was NWO or sticking with WCW. And I was intrigued by this. I was following it. And to be honest with you, Sting was one of the reasons why I sticked watching WCW. It was Sting, NWO... Cruiserweights and the Benoits, the Jerichos, the Eddie Guerreros, that type of style was getting my attention. And, yeah, like they said, Sting stayed with WCW until it ended. I respect Sting for that, you know? That's like, hmm, who can I say stayed with WWF? Triple H when he left WCW and Stone Cold. But, Wrestling wise, it's hard to say. But, you know, and then when WCW ended, Sting went to TNA. I watched TNA, I admit, I watched it. It was amazing back in the day. But TNA screwed up. They messed up big time on Sting. And now he's in WWE. He had that, I think he had a great match with Triple H. You know? And. Now we're going to see a match with him and Rollins, which should be interesting because 
Rollins and AJ Styles have a similar style, so that could be good. And we'll see where it goes, and maybe we'll see a Sting Taker match. Or, but I have a feeling we'll see a Sting Hall of Fame. All right, um, yeah, I think it's awesome that Sting's in WWE now. All right, well that's all I got to say about Sting. If you have any favorite moments or matches about Sting, leave them in the comments down below. Um, my next video, I've been seeing this ABC challenge going around YouTube. I think it's my turn to do that. And um, I'll show off my DVD collection. I believe I made one before, but I haven't updated one, so I'll show the whole thing again. And um, yeah. If you have any suggestions of what you'd like to see in upcoming videos, leave them down below. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be seeing that of the champions. It's up in the air right now. I don't know if I'll have the network by then. So, But I still will make picks. I can't make reviews because I won't be able to see it. But I will still make picks. And um, yeah. If you want me to talk about a certain wrestler, leave who you want me to talk about. I'll give you my honest opinion about the person, even if I don't like them. Alright guys, well that concludes my video for today. Wherever you may be, if it's cloudy, muggy, rainy, hopefully not snowy, enjoy the day. Alright guys, peace out.